Hey guys, what is going on? Thank you so much for tuning into the Captain Popman channel once again. If this is your first time viewing one of my videos and you do like what you see, remember, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and show this UK collector some love, guys. Thank you so much. Okay, so today we're going to do yet a bit of a toy haul video, you know, figures and Funko Pops and things like that that I've amassed since my birthday. Uh, it was my birthday on the 28th of September, so we got some really cool stuff as well as some decent funds to go out toy hunting as well. Uh, there is going to be a toy hunt coming tomorrow, so I'm going to actually heading to Leeds with some of the family, the little bro and things like that tomorrow. So we're going to do a toy hunt, hopefully find some more Marvel Legends, some more Funko Pops. And it has been Force Friday today, Force Friday, so obviously we do have a lot of the new Rise of Skywalker toys out there as well guys so we'll be checking some of those out for your viewing pleasure as well but back to the toy haul today uh, like I say I did manage to get quite a few things so thank you so much to obviously all my family everyone that bought me presents and things like that you know really really appreciative it um, and like I said we're going to go through a few of the things that we've got today so let's have a look so first thing we've got is a new Funko Pop. So I don't know if any of you guys have watched my previous videos. If you have, you know that I don't normally buy that many Funko Pops anymore. I was very much contemplating getting the Avengers Endgame wave of the Pops in the Quantum Realm suits because I do think they look awesome and they would look really good displayed out of the box. And then I still collect certain exclusives and chases and things like that as well. So obviously with that in mind, knowing that I do want to get some of the Endgame Pops, I did get some. So the first one that we actually managed to get for the birthday, guys, is actually Thor from the Avengers Endgame wave in the Quantum Realm suit. Really, really cool pop. Really like that one. I would have liked the FYE Thor exclusive, but unfortunately, Smith sold out. They don't no longer have him anymore. But yeah, I did manage to get this one for my birthday. So he's the first. Really, really happy with that. There you can see some of the other pops in the wave as well. I'm not going to go into too much detail with them, obviously, because I will be reviewing all these separately in upcoming videos, that sort of stuff. But yeah, really, really happy with that, guys. So Thor being the first pop of the of the day that we got. Really, really happy with that. Absolutely awesome. So thank you so much for that one. Uh, the second will continue with pops. So the other one we managed to get was again from the Avengers Endgame wave. You've probably seen on the side already, but that one is actually Black Widow. So yeah, really, really happy with that one as well, guys. Love how she looks. I have seen pics of the glams, so I know that her hair looks really, really cool on the bike. So yeah, if you can see her up close there, guys, she looks really, really awesome holding her two batons. And again, in the Quantum Realm suit. So she's going to look absolutely awesome displayed next to the other Endgame Pops that I've got in the wave. Uh, I do actually have the commons out of the box. So I've got some shelves up on my wall. And basically, I do display a lot of the commons out of the box. And I really just wanted the Avengers Endgame Pops all in a row, all displayed. Boxes behind them, just looking super sweet. So yeah, really, really excited to get these open, get these reviewed for you. And then get them up on the shelf, guys. It's going to look absolutely awesome. So yeah, Black Widow. From the same set, from the same wave. Really, really happy to get that one as well, guys. That is absolutely awesome. Uh, we then, then did get another Avengers Endgame pop. This is one I actually went out and bought myself with some of the birthday money that I've got and things like that. Obviously, we start as we mean to go on, guys. We start as we mean to go on. So, yeah, another Avengers Endgame pop. This time, Nebula in the Quantum Realm suit. Really, really like this one. I took some pictures of this one on my Instagram. Uh, there will have been a little link at the beginning of the video uh, to my Instagram, which is at Captain Popman, same name as the channel, where I take all sorts of photos of my figures and my Funkos and, you know, things like that. So, yeah, I did manage to post a photo of her before I purchased her. Really like the way that she looks. And yeah, guys, just look how sweet she looks. Love that little bit of orange that they've now added to the side of the face, uh, as opposed to the previous Nebula Pops that we used to get. And yeah, really, really happy with that one, guys. Think she looks absolutely awesome. And it is one. That one and Thanos, realistically, as well as Thor, are the ones that I wanted more than any other. So yeah, looks really, really cool. Really, really awesome. So really, really happy to have her, guys. She looks sweet. So let's just move her out of the way there because I don't want to be taking up all the video space you need to see this this needs to be seen <laughs> excuse me so finally the final pop that we managed to get for the birthday uh, again really really happy with this one guys this is again another one from the Avengers Endgame it is a six inch pop and it is the six inch Hulk with the nano gauntlet guys. So really, really excited to open this one. This one looks so sick, really, really cool. And I definitely wanted a pop with the infinity or should I say the nano gauntlet on as well. 
Again, he is from the same wave, so that you can see a bit of box artwork on the side. So he looks really, really cool, really, really happy with that one. I think he looks absolutely sweet. More of the, the set on the back there, so you can see a few more. Again, I'm not going to go into too much detail with them, guys, because we will do separate unboxing and review videos for each of these. Even if they are only five, six, seven minutes long, you know, for each Funko Pop, it's just more content for you guys. So, yeah, we will do separate videos for them all. But, yeah, really, really happy with this one. think he looks absolutely awesome. Yeah, and it'll, a bit of a closer look at him. Sorry about the glare. But you can see him there with the Infinity Gauntlet, guys. He looks absolutely sick, and I'm really, really excited to get him out of the box. So, yeah. Really, really happy with that, guys. Really cool little haul, to be honest with you, in regards to the Funko Pops. Again, like I said, very, very rare that I will go out and buy them now, unless, like I say, it's a chase, unless it's an exclusive, or unless it's one that really stands out to me. Uh, the last one I did buy was the Captain Marvel chase. Uh, again, it's a chase, so I've got to buy it. But I'm really thinking that I'm going to start getting a lot more of the Marvel Pops, especially the Marvel MCU, seeing as I collect Legends and things like that. I would really like a lot more of the MCU characters in pop form, in Marvel Legends form, and also in Diamond Gallery PVC statue form. So yeah, we're going to be featuring some of those upcoming on the channel when we start to purchase them as well, because I have thought I would like some statues in the collection. Um, so yeah, I will start buying them at some stage. Not sure when yet, we've still got a lot of Legends to get, but I will do at some stage. So yeah, that's it for the Pops. Now, as always, it wouldn't be a birthday haul without Marvel Legends, baby. We love those Marvel Legends, as you know. Absolutely adore them on this channel. Love the figures, love the articulation, love posing them and displaying them on the shelves, guys. So yeah, really, really happy. Had to get some Marvel Legends. So the first one that we did manage to get, as you can probably see just here, actually is the Spider-Man uh, in the upgraded suit. So this one is actually from the Spider-Man Far From Home wave, and it is in the UK repackaging, guys. So as far as I'm aware, uh, the one that did get released in the normal packaging doesn't come with any further accessories. He didn't come with any bath piece. He was the first in the wave, and you will find a lot of the time that the first in the actual wave with bath pieces don't actually come with bath pieces, if that makes any sense, if you get me. So yeah, he actually comes with exactly what he comes with in the normal box. So yeah, really, really happy to get him, guys. He looks absolutely sweet. So yeah, there you can see the upgraded suit Spider-Man. Excited to get him out of the box. I did just review the stealth suit Spider-Man or Night Monkey from the same wave in the UK repackaging, guys. If you haven't checked out that video already, please go check that out. Really, really appreciate that. But yeah, I'm excited to actually have the upgraded suit as well as the stealth suit Spider-Man. Then we've already got Mysterio from the wave as well. And that's pretty much redone for that wave, guys. Really, really excited to open this one. So yeah, really, really cool. Really, really happy to get this. It looks absolutely sweet. Uh, so the next one, the next Marvel Legend that we actually managed to pick up was one from the Black Panther Wave. And that is Eric Killmonger, obviously the main bad guy from the Black Panther uh, movie. Uh, if you've not seen the Black Panther movie, I highly suggest you go check it out, guys. I've watched it maybe twice, two, three times now, I think it is. And I actually really enjoyed it a lot more the second and third time than the first. So yeah, really, really cool movie. But love this figure. I think it looks absolutely sick. Uh, love that face sculpt actually of Eric Killmonger and obviously he comes with the M'Baku head and stuff as well. Again, we will go through that in more detail when we do an unboxing and a review video guys. But yeah, really, really happy with that one. That is one that I've wanted for a while. Saw that face sculpt and was like, my God, look how sick he looks. So yeah, really, really excited for that one guys. You see we've got a nice little product shot, nice shot of him there as well with some of the other figures in the wave. But yeah, really, really happy with this one. So excited to unbox this one. And then the final one, the final thing that we got for the birthday, guys. This was some, spending some of the birthday money. Another Marvel legend. Final Marvel legend of the haul. Don't worry, we will be going to get some more tomorrow from Forbidden Planet Leeds. Don't you worry about that. But yeah, the final one from the haul today, guys, is actually from the Avengers Endgame Wave 1. And that is the Ronin figure. Ronin slash Clint Barton slash... Hawkeye, whichever you want to call him, it is the Ronin figure from Avengers Endgame. And you can see it comes with the Armored Thanos arm builder figure piece. But really like this one as well, guys. Really, really excited to get this one open. Some nice artwork on the side. Nice, obviously, product shot of Ronin there. 
and then a few of the other figures in the wave as well, guys. But yeah, this is one I've wanted for a while. I have passed on him a few times, seen him in the shops. Uh, when I went to the hub in Doncaster, I saw him, passed on him then. I have seen him in Forbidden Planet Nottingham as well, but this time I couldn't pass up on him, guys. Had to get him. You know, he's around 30 quid on Amazon, and I got him for 20 quid. So yeah, really, really happy with that. And again, really excited to get him out of the box, get him posed up, and get him on the shelf, guys, and take some awesome product shots for you, that sort of stuff. So yeah, really, really happy, guys. So yeah, overall, I think it's been a pretty good birthday haul, to be honest with you. Like I say, we've got Funko Pops, we've got Marvel Legends. That is what we love to collect at the moment, as you guys know. We will be going to Forbidden Planet Leeds on Saturday, so really, really excited for that one. Uh, go on a toy hunt and see what we can find for you. Hoping for some Marvel Legends. Uh, I obviously, I'm looking out for double pikes. I am looking out for ones that I don't have from the MCU, that sort of stuff. So fingers crossed that they have something sweet to look at and something sweet to buy on that day. But yeah, thank you so much for tuning into the toy haul video, guys. Really, really hope you've enjoyed it. I really enjoyed getting this stuff. Again, it was my birthday last Saturday. So yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. Really, really appreciate it, guys. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. All about that subscribe life, as you guys already know. But yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. And as always, take it easy.